When using RPG Maker MC's built-in character generator, you can customise each part's colours. However, you may have noticed that there are only a handful of colours available, and you might not be able to find a colour that you want to use. You can edit the generator files in order to edit and add colours to this palette. You will need to find where RPG Maker MZ is installed on your computer. If you are using the standalone version, it will likely be in your hard drive's program files folder. If you are using the Steam version, you will need to find your Steam folder. In the Steam folder, go to Steam Apps, Common, RPG Maker MZ, Generator. This is where you'll find the images for the generator's parts. There are four images in this folder called Grad Common, Grad Eyes, Grad Hair, and Grad Skin. The grad is short for gradient, and each of these files will determine what colours are available for eyes, hair, skin, and other parts that share common colours. To add or edit the colours in these files, you'll need to open them in an image editing software. I personally use GIMP, but you can use almost anything to accomplish the same thing. When you open one of these files, you'll notice that each colour is a long strip of gradient that is 4 pixels tall. To add a new colour, change the image's canvas size to add 4 pixels to the height. Use the selection box tool to select the newly added area and locate the gradient tool. You can use the gradient tool to customise what colours to add. You should aim to make it look similar to the existing colours, with the lighter section on the left that fades into the darker colour on the right. When you're happy with the new colour, save the image and return to RPG Maker MZ. You may need to restart the engine before the colour will appear in the editor. You can now select the new colour to customise your parts. Thanks for watching, and happy game developing!